Well, the church convention gathered in Town Point Park Friday, hoping to feed as many people as possible. Yeah, the I Congress is in town for its annual conference and wanted to give back during a time of inflation and food insecurity across the country. Sarah Hammond has the story. The goal Friday afternoon is to feed 1,000 people and provide free health care screenings for those that need it most. As part of the annual International Congress of the Church of Our Lord Jesus Christ, church leaders from across the country joined together to provide a warm plate of food. There are still people that's hungry. And so one of the key things is how do we provide food to people that are really in need? Deacon Marquise Elrose points to the containers of chicken, rice, and collard greens as their way of giving back while in town. 44 million people in the U.S. are food insecure. 13 million of them are children, according to Feeding America. Almost 50 million people are turning to organizations for help, but those organizations sometimes don't have the supplies they need. We told you last month the Virginia Peninsula Food Bank was out of most of the donations they received during the holidays while they were seeing a spike of people in need. Food insecurity can also cause chronic illness, so Celebrate Healthcare's Gaylene Knoyton also brought healthcare screenings to Friday's event. You have to have nutrition in order to be healthy, and you have to know what your numbers are. Are. So if this works hand in hand together. James Clark says he hopes what they're doing Friday in Norfolk spurs more people to give back. But we're going to go. We're going to leave. But perhaps uh, this will encourage and incentivize others. According to Feeding America, 27,000 people in Norfolk are food insecure. 704,000 in Virginia as a whole. In Norfolk, Sarah Hammond, 13 News Now. Coming up on 13 News Now at 6, hear how food insecurity can also shave years off your life, according to a new study.